They may be seen as boys' toys, but more Chinese women are developing a preference for luxury cars. According to research firm Nielsen, one quarter of luxury car owners in China last year were female, and dealers are going out of their way to get their business. Grace Brown has this. Wang Yueting is an architect in Beijing. Between her busy schedule, she enjoys road trips outside the city in her new wheels. I bought it last year. And it is a pretty nice car because the speed and the good quality and uh, the whole design and the color. In my mind, the German-made car will be safer. According to the latest Hu Run report, one in three Chinese millionaires are women. And increasingly, they're driving high-end auto sales. In 2011, women accounted for a third of Maserati sales in China, compared to 10 percent in Europe. Women also made up 30 percent of Ferrari's China sales in 2012, compared to 10 percent in the United States. As Chinese women become more affluent, more car makers are marketing to them. But engaging them in store isn't easy. According to a recent survey by research firm Group M, Chinese women place a much higher value on good service than Chinese men when it comes to buying a car. The survey from consumers across China found that the test drive was the top priority for men, while service ranked first for women. Dealers are going all out to woo them. But in most customers need more careful and more stable service. For the female customers, we just hope to make them think it's not too fast, we can stay, we can just drive in stables and we can just uh, focusing on the safety. We can provide more and more colors and show the jewelry, show the cars and just do a related for these two different products. Research firm Nielsen says a quarter of China's luxury car owners are women. They are not just only in, in depending on their male partners or the, uh, their fathers to fund the, the cars. Some of them are business owners, top stars, high-income females uh, will be the future uh, buyers of these black cars. And they are more independent and uh, have the strong desire to express them themselves. Limits on license plates and car purchases, along with a corruption crackdown, pose new headwinds for auto sales in China. But with fewer female officials than male, wealthy women are offering high-end car makers an increasingly attractive bet. Grace Brown, CCTV, Beijing.